Hello everyone. What I'm selling is this combination of motor, by the way, it's an escape, escape 28 motor. I believe it's um, Swiss, Swiss made in Switzerland. And it's got a, a small steel gear and a large gear. And it's got a one quarter inch screw with ducting like, like actuator. At the end of this part is have a couple bearings. I don't know that might be used to to align because it's got uh, you know display having a screw they probably need to be aligned in something else well um, usually I take apart the pieces and I sell separate like the motor and the uh, and the gears but I decide to sell it the one whole thing you know it's a tiny linear actuator um, this move this way, but that way is not move at all. So that's uh, that's why I assume those uh, gears are for resting in some other in some other base. You you maybe have to build in here. So <clears throat> you see the holes in here, and this is maybe for another part to be resting and then anyway uh, let me plug in it's a DC motor it's a, it's a DC motor and let me tell you what it does let's see I, if I invert the, the wires and then of course then I will increase the speed and see what's happening. Oh my God! It's very... I believe the motor itself is probably I don't know. Maybe I just running about 15 volts. I gonna up to 20. It's gonna be even faster. Right? I definitely that spindle at least uh, is run about 3000 rpm but you know I can measure because you know the gears and everything um, anyway let's put in a slow speed and see how how, uh, how how very slow speed is start to travel this let's see in bolts perhaps let's see Yeah, probably that a good speed. This is the minimum, perhaps. That's the minimum and the highest for this. Well, my power supply is just two. You know, it's 250 milliamps. So I went to sell the whole thing for twenty-two dollars and ninety-nine cents. And this heavy about this package is going to be around a little bit over two pounds or two pounds. So I need to charge her dollar and fifty cents for shipping. Unfortunately, it can't fit in the flat rate box, a small flat rate box, and I have to take it apart. It is uh, and it's too much. So I'm going to build a box for and charge a fifty for shipping. I'm going to build a small box for this. And it's a fifty for shipping, twenty-two dollars ninety-nine cents for the whole thing, including the motor, the gears, or uh, pulleys, uh, this the screw. This is a uh, this is aluminum. This is anodized aluminum. The other one is regular aluminum, the back, and this is kind of a uh, steel. This the moving part, and it's got a. 
many holes to maybe design an axis or well many application but you know I decided to sell them like completely like this $22.99 $8.50 shipping thank you we'll take some pictures